<laughs> Alright man, let's start it from here, man. Fucking DVS. <laughs> yeah, oh. this needs to get. Yeah. Alright, cool man. We just had a little catch up. Um Yeah man. Oh shit, he says he wants a ten second silence. Alright, cool. From now on. I'm sorry, Alex. <laughs> Why, why, why can you why, never why, do it? Why did you feel your face like that? Because I'm concentrating. Like in school. All right, 10 seconds silence from now. That was 10 seconds. Thank you. You killed me. No. Like I, you <laughs> exactly like... Do you know what it is? I have to concentrate and not being quiet. Like That's crazy. Having like, to concentrate to be quiet is not. No, you have, like, because... The like, barefoot like in here. Messi, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> you, see the, you see that new me- Messi call video <laughs> that was blowing around the other day. Aye. That shit's a killing no, me. No, man. Messi's so autistic, Aye, man. Yeah, sh- <laughs> I didn't want to say it. I didn't want to say it. But, but you, know what, you know what killed me? Um, the video of Messi crying, yeah. Like, like I get why he was crying um, in the copper. In the front. Well, I only saw the picture. I was like, this nigga's crying. <laughs> like, you know. Wait, hey, where's this? You know, um, you when you rolled his oh, ankle, oh, when you rolled, oh yeah, 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 like, yeah. I get, I get. It was painful, and you're out like of the most important match yet. But you know the ones yet have a little composure. Yeah, uh, bro. Do you know a... what? It was even the fact that Garnacho was set next to him. And I swear <laughs> to you, Garnacho had this look on his face like, big man. Waste, yeah, man. like, what fuck's wrong with you? Like, bro, you're meant to be the big homie right now. Like, like, I do know. You know. Do you know what was even crazier? Do you remember Cristiano? Oh, the Euros. Pro- oh, man. Like, oh, halfway through extra time, game ain't even finished. Yeah, I get I get, I, 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 I get it after a game. You lost a game. Yeah. I've, I've cried. I've cried that like, under seven. Crying during yeah, the yeah, game yeah. is nuts. Cry, crying during the game, yeah. If I see my main man, like, leader and captain, crying, I'm thinking, this shit yeah, is... Because my thing is, like, how am I supposed to follow you into Warner? Bro. <laughs> how am I supposed to get behind you, pause? Like, if this is how you're... I imagine niggas are riding out, yeah, and the guy... And the front wheel was sobbing his fucking like, I don't I don't wanna do this. <laughs> get me out of the car. <laughs> hey, get me out of here, man. Oh my days. That uh, was crazy. But uh man. What episode is this by the way? Ninety seven, I believe. Oh shit. Sure. Okay, Ninety seven or close. So yeah. Um You saying you got any celebration plans for the centenary? Yeah. yeah. Um I've been trying to sort something out. Mm. Uh, even it was so funny, on the Patreon there's like a chat with all the members. Yeah. And guys were like Someone's like, I know you, because they, they were expecting a live show, and I just burst a bubble. I was like, nah, it's, the live show is definitely not going to happen, because yeah, yeah, that's yeah, too yeah, much yeah, thought yeah. process. Yeah, yeah. And we tried to do a live show, and niggas at Prince of Peckham, they were just messing me about like, it. <laughs> but yeah, so then, um, that was like, just, nah, why don't you just do this, do that, do that? And I was like, slow down, like, let me, like, they really think I'm just gonna hit them with a normal episode. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I was yeah, like, yeah. bro, it's been a hundred. We all cook something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. God willing, it all, all goes through but you know you know you know go with it mm. but yeah, we got something for you, yeah bro. but glad to have you back man hey hey as always brother hey, pre- hey, pre- hey pre- post-season <laughs> yeah How, how's life man listen i can't lie post-season is always a little bit life feels different bro yeah. i can't lie there's, there's a sense of freedom that comes of it but I, I'd be lying if I said this one was good, bro, because I've been I've been dying with like this fucking flu for like yeah. three or four weeks. I, 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 I told you, I, I don't like, know what's it. been going around. Yeah. I had to get tested. Like it got to the point where what kind of test? You know what? You know when it comes to Alex, you yeah. know. <laughs> <laughs> now, no, to be fair, <laughs> hey, you know when you know when you know when they said um, back in like four years ago when they said. Um, there's like the new COVID's got like some chlamydia symptoms, yeah, bro, yeah. The new strain, <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that must be it. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 I got to the point where I was ill for mad long, yeah, and my meat side itching, yeah, and I was just like, Whoa. that was placebo, Whoa. man. No, nah, but you know, but you know the ones where your head's thinking all over the gap, yeah, 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 yeah. Got to the point, so I got COVID tested, and I said, fuck it, I'm gonna get the the clinic test because I don't know why I'm feeling like this, and mm. then um, came back all negative. Except for flipping COVID, and I was so happy. And I, and the thing about me, I haven't done anything treacherous in like a year. So, yeah. but I think them tests, I'm, I don't know, one little little like uncomfortability down there. You're saying you just like itching. I, I just I overthink. Yeah. I I get PTSD. Like, <laughs> itchy. I'm so glad I've never had to deal with that, bro. But I always think, bro, catching a fucking cold or flu or anything in the summer is just the worst, yeah, bro. bro. Like you it's see. The worst. In the winter, it's calm. You're hibernating. Literally, you got, you yeah. got the hot you're, water bottle. You're, you know? you're meant to have a you're, flu. You're, you're meant yeah, to have a flu. It's a seasonal change. I don't mind getting sick in the winter. 
Yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like that's part and parcel of the program. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's your body saying, summer, let's have a break. Yeah. Nah, bro, you're cracking the window. You're like, hey, sun's out. <laughs> yeah. like, uh, that's the only time where I feel sorry for Hayfee for brothers. Yeah. Because no, normally, I'm... Hay Hayfee was coming gone this, this, yeah. like, this summer. I can't lie, I'd be Thank one God. of them niggas. Be like, you niggas can't breathe. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> I used to be I used to be like that, bro. Like, I used to be like that, but then it started affecting me. I yeah, yeah. That's what I heard, you know. I heard Hayfee can hit you any time, any age. So I was like, you know what? Let me chill on the jokes. Yeah, I used to, I used to hate chilling with my dad in the summer. This nigga always uh, scratching his throat, like you know. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's the noise as well, bro. Hey, hey, hey you, like peacocks out yeah, here, bro. Bro, it used to jar me so much, oh, and then shit. I turned twenty one, yeah, and like I was like, I need to scratch my throat. And I was like, I'm looking like some oh, old ass nigga. <laughs> No. And I was like, nah, man, I'm just like my pups. <laughs> but now, nah, like, oh yeah, days. nah, hay, hay fever hasn't been that bad this year. But when I caught the cold, like, two weeks ago, yeah, you know, uh, my mum always used to tell me this. Like, <clears throat> you know you have the flu. It's like, if if I put 20 pounds on this, on at the front door, you won't go get it. And then there was a, I ordered the um, delivery because I was hungry. Yeah. Guy knocked on my door. <sighs> that. That got left at the front door for about a good two, three hours. You're joking. Bro, I could like I wanted food, but my but body said my food, body yeah. said no. Like I was yeah. like my body. <laughs> <laughs> <It> sure, You heard the new the new snippet of his singing in jail. <laughs> Oh my God. It's so funny. It's, it's always like the same type of video, yeah? <laughs> Where a man are recording like outside the cell, yeah? And like all, everyone's all locked up and it's bare quiet. Aye. And it's and it's like silence. You just hear him belting out. Yeah. One brother belting. Hey. Oh man. Whenever nowadays I see phone videos from jail cells, I'm always a little bit. Yeah, I'm scared, man. Yeah, 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 What's about to happen yeah, here man. now? Never know what you might see, bro. That when I was singing, I was like, what type of singing? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's crazy. That video. I had to put that on the big screen, man. You're insane. Yeah, I, nah, I, I just, man, uh, bro, I shook my head, bro. I, I, couldn't, was, I, was, I couldn't believe this shit was happening in 2024. The, d what, trains? Oh, no, it wasn't even a train. It was just, what do you even call that? It's, it wasn't a train. They had sex, innit? it? Nah, the, bro, the, bro, having sex is fine. The, the nigga recording, yeah, was just... I, that, I, was, I, that was the craziest. I can't lie, him recording like, is dumb. Because now I don't know you got a phone, you were blinding, blinding a spliff, and you lost your eater. Bro, but I, the I think, ultimate L in yeah. every facet, bro. Yeah, it, like, it just you, made no it sense. It doesn't make any sense. Nah, all right, cool. But even my my like my girls all got a man in that and cool. But what? Why would you wife a screw? I don't understand. It makes no. I sense. don't think women should be allowed to work him in prison. And saying vice versa. Yeah, right, that, versa. Like, there's there's no need. Like, what are you doing? Like, imagine you're taking a shorty out and you're chopping up over dinner and she. And you, yeah, what'd you do? Yeah, working a what? Yeah, what? safe. I used to safe. I used to date a girl who used to work in um security. Like, no, she was like a prison. What are they called? Um, prison officers. I don't know what they're called. Yeah, prison. Yeah, prison yeah, officers. Yeah. 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 Scars, and then scars, um, she was just telling me about how the man, the madness that goes on. Yeah, I think one of the prisoners set her up, as in, told someone that he, she's helping him supply drugs, mm -hmm. and she was like, "Oh, why did you say that?" And then um, I think the guy was like bored, like schizophrenic. Yeah. yeah. So he just had like, like there's mad, like, like her madness was like people would just be lying because you're pretty and attractive, mm -hmm. and or they're just trying to sleep with her. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, some men like with me, I don't, I, I, I don't think I'll give in, mm -hmm. and I ain't risking my job. No. But I get, like some of my friends would. For instance, what and do you mean, sorry? Like, you, what, would, as you in, if you, you were chop a female prisoner? Nah, I wouldn't. I don't think I would either. But I get why. I don't want sexual relations with anyone who's capable you, of going to prison. What if you you got forty years though? You know, no, I'm not. a prison officer. You're a prison officer. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I ain't risking that. That makes that's the part I didn't get as well. Yeah, it was like yeah. the the bread filming and then the governor. Well. I'm like, I, I know they don't pay you much. Yeah. But it's it's a living. Okay. It's a good living. You yeah. you probably get a little danger pay as well. Yeah, but the thing is, you have to understand something. With you. I don't know what it's like for a woman, but a lot of these brothers you work in prison. They, man, them, them, they become inmates, bro. But that's the thing. Yeah. Women around it so much, and you just you get me. I yeah, think women. To, it almost yeah. becomes like a culture, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. But I think it's back to it. Like women love criminals. Women love love a criminal. Yeah. And women love a man in jail. Women, don't, don't, women love. Women love a criminal. 
the criminals like oh my god like he does all of this but he treats me right yeah yeah, yeah. get me they take pride like in that. a criminal with a gift of the gap yeah, 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 yeah. and you know there's plenty of criminals yeah, out there yeah, with yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. girls girls love guys in jail because they always know where they are <sighs> they ain't no bitches around yeah, them. Yeah. <laughs> and they're all they're always doing the most yeah. guys in jail with girlfriends are always doing the most yeah. love letters every day yeah. phone calls for help like Everything a woman wants from a man outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you like, think I ain't been getting messages? Yo, send me a bill so I can get this. Are you fucking <laughs> mad? <laughs> you know where that's going. Bro, you send know me where that's going. So I can buy something for this girl. You're crazy, bro. Hey. Bon- bonkers. Yeah, like I, I, I send. I used to send uh, my boy some some money. Yeah. And then um, I was dark to know like, what, like what, what are you using this for? And he was being a responsible man, but I was like, it's I know him at the same noodles. time, like. You you're up to some bullshit, aren't you? Yeah, like, yeah. I know, but I'm I'm hearing like tin, I don't know, Tinder tuna expensive over there. <laughs> the fish is expensive. Bro, bonkers. Even, you said I, the mackerel. The mackerel, the yeah. bro. Was, you know, man, are in there playing um, Pez thirteen for mackerel. <laughs> you know, uh, cigarettes gets crazy. Yeah, as yeah well. man, are yeah, playing yeah, Pez thirteen yeah, for yeah. cigarettes. You play Pez, that there's two out of three for fit for like three for mackerel. Yeah, That's the man. thing. You'd crack in prison just for cigarettes. Nah. I really? think that's the point when I quit. Is it? Yeah. I feel like me, if I went jail, I'd become one of them, like, just thousand push-ups a day. Just read a book. No, I heard five it. prayers yeah. a day. That's the moment, like, you lock in. <laughs> you know, you know. I, you always say you got to lock in. You know that's what? what I'm like, you know what? Now i got to lock in. You know what? I always say, like, ah, oh, yeah, if I go to prison, I'm going to get a routine. I'm going to be, <laughs> I'm going to be sleeping. I'm going to be trying to sleep in so much. <laughs> <laughs> no, I feel like that's the one time where you're like, yo, there's no distractions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's yeah. no cheese, I get a there's good no... night's sleep. But bro, <laughs> eight hours, I'm getting solid. I'm waking up it all dep- five prayers. I'm like, yeah. yo, I'm on it. But, but it depends on the sentence, yeah. If yeah. you're telling the man, like, 20 plus years, it's like, ah. But if you're telling me two years, it's like, okay, I can get, I can make a business. Plan. I can yeah, see yeah, yeah, two yeah, years yeah. away. But yeah. you know that 20 plus years, that I'll be so demotivated, bro. Like, yeah. I... I Legit think I'll do anything for sleeping pills. <laughs> like guys will guys will be doing off all these drugs, but I just want to be sleeping. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I watched this um Netflix show, was it? Um I can't remember where they were doing like some prison sentence like that. A man would just make it huge. You know, they're just <laughs> regular, regular. I was like, yo, American prisons yeah are yeah. so different to UK yeah, yeah, as well. well. I think that's why everyone like in UK they <coughs> think UK prisons are like America's prison. Where there might be some sorts of it, but that's where everyone's got their main. They've seen a prison, if you know yeah. what I mean. Yeah. So like, I don't think it'll be like proper. I ain't never been to prison, but I've heard stories. Like they they were talking about making like ties and things like this, like tying all these little strings in, and that's how they make their lighters yeah. and. Bro, yeah. I was like, in America, they get proper creative, bro, because they, yeah. they they just get down, locked yeah. down for 23 yeah, hours, yeah, bro. Yeah. Man, I'm like, I get that one hour freedom, yeah? Well, I'm going to make the most of that shit. Bro, having one hour freedom is bonkers, bro. Bro, crazy. One hour these days flies. Like, I w- even today, I was meant to, I was getting ready. Mm. I thought I had so much time. Yeah. Next minute, seven minutes went, like, in the blink of an eye. Yeah. I was like, cool, cool, let me start getting ready. 30 minutes gone. And I was like, damn. But today's a bit different. Cause it's a bit early as well. Yeah. I ain't, only time I've bro, ever called. I was, I was fuming when you told me pod time, bro. I can't lie. Like, <laughs> what kind of two p.m. Like, yo, I'm getting drunk to work. Like, you, this, <laughs> this is my off season. This is when I wake <laughs> up at two p.m. I was, I was telling when the man I was said livid, Thursday, I said, "Yeah, but I'm getting drunk to work drinks, so yeah, it has yeah. to be early." But that's the thing. Like when my sleeping pattern's a mess, yeah. Like two p.m. legit is about ten a.m. for me. That's crazy, like, bro. I slept seven a.m. this morning. I that's five a.m. for me. What were you doing till seven a.m.? I was just up chilling. Bro. I couldn't sleep though. That's crazy. Uh, uh, people always like, ask people, me that. People think like there's this, uh, bro, I'm just up chilling. I'll bro. be on my phone. I'll be playing football manager. Bro. I'll that, watch Netflix. That's like me. Like, I feel the problem with me, yeah, I cause during the, like during normal hours, yeah, I yeah. can't get anything done. You see when the world's awake, mm-hmm. I can't, st- like, I feel, what it feels like, there's a million voices in my head, like from texting, Insta DMs or whatever. I feel You're like, so neurodivergent. Yeah, like I feel like there's a, so much noise in the head. Yeah. As soon as 11 p.m. hits, for me it's like midnight. Cause yeah, yeah, midnight. Midnight is usually when I go like gym, and I go them times because I'm like, yeah, Batman. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's asleep <laughs> these times. I'm the only one getting it in now. <laughs> well, and then afterwards, here. I'm just like up, oh, just got the pump. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, cool, 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 cool. From but 12 to 7, I I can get to bed like 5 6 a.m. Yeah. That's a decent night for me. Getting to bed at 5 6 a.m. But as soon as, if I try to do it all night to refix my sleeping pattern, yeah, 
what I notice, come nine ten, the noises in my head. Wow, I can't do anything. I that happened to me once, you know. Like, <laughs> there was a there was a period where shout out Peach. Me and Peach used to go to gym together on a, at six a.m. Like a couple like like once a week. Yeah, and then I, I just couldn't sleep. I was up, mm. as in I just couldn't sleep. Yeah, I was in bed for time and I couldn't sleep. Then it got to like four a.m. Fuck, and I was like, I got about this nigga in two hours. No, and then you know like, the panic starts. Sleep. Start, the panic mm. starts. And then I was like, it got to the four a.m. and I was like, there's no point. So I just turned my PlayStation yeah, yeah. on. Yeah. Went uh, gym. Had a gym session on literally. I'd been awake for twenty four hours. I had a gym session on no sleep. I had a good gym session. Yeah. Mm. When I the thing is though, it was so crazy because by the time I got to the gym, I think the adrenaline kicked, kicked in and I wasn't tired no more. Oh yeah, that's. But then as soon as literally, I said safe to peach. As soon as the handshake finished <laughs> and he walked off, <laughs> my body crashed. Yeah. And I, I damn near, I damn near passed out. See when you do like an all nighter and it hits one to two p.m. Yeah, and your time. brain is a fuzz. Yeah, like your, I always have like an out of body experience where. I'm not me. I'm just looking around. I'm I'm a shell of myself yeah. at, at this point. Like, I need to sleep, but yeah. then I'm like, why well, am I gonna go sleep at one p.m.? Like it would just I'll just wake up at ten. Yeah. Have you ever Zero been up. so tired that you can't sleep? I know it sounds crazy. Now fully, so yeah, yeah, tired. yeah. Oh, that's what happens because like, you see, it'll be like it'll reach like one or two, and I'll be like, you know what? Let me get a nap. Yeah, impossible. Sleep, yeah. yeah, impossible. Yeah. And then it, you get to like ten. Now I'm like, I I need an early night for yeah. some reason. I'll Brain. still be able to go into the next day yeah. running on like one yeah. hour sleep, bro. I, yeah. My sleeping pattern's been fucked. Yeah, years, it's man. crazy because you don't. Re- the sleep sleep is so important, but then so important. some. I, I ever had that thing where you're doing something. Let's say you're you're out or you're whatever, and you're dozing off. Mm. Oh yeah. But yeah, then yeah. as soon as you get into bed, you can't sleep. Bro. Yeah, that's the worst it's feeling. Fucked. Like that's even the worst even um, when we was working on the railway. Um, what was saying when I was working on the railway, bro? Like the sleeping issues I was having. And that's when I got introduced to drinking to go yeah. to sleep. That's that's that's, crazy. that's when I was messed up, yeah. That's crazy. And uh, my guy was just like, bro, because we have to go from <laughs> night shift to day shift. So yeah. imagine finishing on a Friday night. Yeah. So finishing on a Friday morning, but you're back on Saturday morning at 7 a.m. So you're think- So you finish when, sorry? You finish? Fr- so Friday morning at 7 a.m. Yeah. I finish. So, but I'm back to work at Saturday, 7 a.m. So you- Oh That's, shit! So I'm. I've just finished the night shift. I yeah. come home Friday morning. I can't sleep, or I'll go to sleep seven a.m. till mm-hmm. three p.m. Mm-hmm. And I wake up. Cool. Let me get my day started. Oh, I have to wake up at six a.m. So I'm you fit. technically have to do an all nighter after that. Bro, I just shift. do it. Oh, yeah. But then I got introduced to, bro, have a few drinks, and that ruined my life, bro. Oh. I could I could easily drink a whole bottle of tequila, and That's crazy. Not be finished, and I'll just be like, alright, cool. I can go to bed now. That like it was, that was like when it's I was like sickness, 22, bro. 22 ish. That's when you're in your, your liver's in your prime where you could, <laughs> you could abuse it a little, a little, but nah, like that, yeah, it finished me. I wanted to ask you like something. Mm. Has, have you like, ever had dreams, yeah, where you can control it, like fully, like you're writing your own dream? A few Partially. times over the years, but, but like only a little bit because I think sometimes you don't really realize you can. Because you're yeah. in such a, you're in that state where you're yeah. dreaming. You don't really realise, oh shit, I'm in control here. Bro, yeah. but I, I was having, I ha- had it about four times this past week. And then each time was getting better and better. Yeah. And then... So you say he was getting more and more control. Yeah, yeah, like, no, 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 no. I felt like Atlas, my writing skills was just better. <laughs> I swear, I swear. Like, I, to, like, to, like, write an entertaining <laughs> story for myself. And then, so the, the first three times, yeah. I was too excited and I'd wake up. Mm. You're saying too horny? No, 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 no that's the thing. There weren't the, them, them, them nasty dreams, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Some, sometimes that happens. <laughs> you know when you I have, have them in years. You know, you know when you have like a wet dream and you're about to slide it in because you're bare excited and you just wake up. <laughs> you're, you're bare... Bro, it's always the minute I, I'm about to get any contact. When you're about to touch my face, I'm like, hey, yo, 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 yo. We got it, come back, come back, come back. Man, you know, you wake like, up yeah. and you want to go back to sleep to finish the dream. Oh. No, nah, I don't work like that. It's gone. Uh, <laughs> that one's gone. Oh, man. But yeah, then... um. Then the the last one, yeah, I just had writer's block and the dream stuck. Like, I can't explain it. That's crazy. Like, the dream was just... <laughs> said I got writer's block. Because <laughs> <Like, laughs> cause I was Yo, forcibly you, thinking about... How fuck do you have to be to have writer's block in your That's dream? So like, like, <laughs> but the thing is, it was going on, it felt like 45 minutes. Yeah. And then it got to the point, it was like on YouTube and I was buffering. Yeah. And I was like, all right, cool, don't, don't worry, don't worry. It's and coming, like, it's loaded. I was thinking about something, yeah. Mm. 
and it worked like it was a Winnie Pooh dream and I turned into a monster and I bit a gorilla's bum like clean off and then I said yeah how do you remember your dreams I don't remember yeah. like none of my dreams I, rem- I remember certain bits like that's, what, a, that's the remember, crazy part to remember though but what? it's the out this, <laughs> the bit, <laughs> that's so crazy like, you're but no no that's the bit I remember because I was like this story's shit now yeah. <laughs> so, I was, so I was so angry I just woke you up you brought me back to my normal <laughs> settings man what the fuck <laughs> Uh, Do you know yeah. the worst ones are for me? It's like I've had ones where I feel like I'm in control, and then like I'm jumping, but then when I jump, I don't land back down. If that makes sense. You ever flown in a dream? It's uh, bro. It's like a floating thing basically. I'm nah, jumping I, and I'm waiting to come back yeah. down, and I'm like, it's almost like slowly yeah, coming back, yeah, and I'm yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yo, I need to speed this shit up. Yeah. But I don't know if you men have ever had. That. What they yeah. say about throwing punches in dreams is so true. Facts. Yeah, yeah, it's hard, it's hard. Bro, my nigga, you cock something back, pause in your dream, you're it, punching for like three minutes. Bro, the guy's seen it from a mile away. Bro, but I had the worst one, you know, like when you have a flashback to like your childhood. Yeah. I don't know why. I, it that took me memory. back to secondary school, yeah, in this dream. And I remember just being surrounded by everyone. And there's this you, for some reason, worth squaring mm-hmm. off. And I threw like a hundred punches. But yeah. when I tell you all of them are going... Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, no, 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 no. Yeah. They're, they're not even landing. They're just going <laughs> like this. Yeah. So I'm like, bro, what's happening with my punch? And everyone's just looking at me. Yeah. And I'm like, bro, dreams are so yeah. fucked. I've only had really. two. I've only had two dreams that I was concerned. Like I was so concerned for my mental health. Yeah. <laughs> there was one dream. I think I've told this story before where I was on the roof yeah. of my school and I, was, I had a sniper. <coughs> and I've locked it on to someone. And he's turned around and it's myself. <laughs> and I've pressed the trigger and all we had is bang and I woke up. Yo. And I was like, yo, like. Why did you press the trigger? <laughs> bro, I wanted to see what happened. Bro, <laughs> I hear it still. Bro, but it was just like, the bang, it woke me up. And then the the last messed up dream, it what happened was so fucked up. It was like, um, so it started off with. I've turned over and I felt a force behind my back trying to cuddle me. Yeah. And I'm like, no one's in my bed. So mm. I can't even so I can't even turn I'm so scared. And then squeeze up my legs. Nah, nah. He was whispering nasty things in my ear. Mm. He was basically telling me to kill my whole family. And I'm like I'm like, oh, I'm not saying okay, but I'm like, can you just go away? And then I've shut my eyes extra hard and I feel myself being dragged out of bed, yeah? And then I'm so scared and I've woken up now and I'm just like, I've woken up at the edge of my bed like this. And I was like... Yeah, that might have been a gin still. But What's you that? sleepwalk, innit? Yeah, I, I, sleep, yeah. I, sleep, I sleepwalk sometimes as well, which is fucked up. That's yes. mad. Bro, my sleepwalk... I heard up. if you wake someone up when they sleepwalk, they could have like a... Yeah, a, my a, mum... A spasm or you're something. You're not supposed to wake them up. So my mum... So I was sleepwalking and my mum woke me up and... It was smack the shit out of me. No, no, no. So I've, I'm walking around, bro. I'm walking around the cor- I'm walking around like the corridor. Bitch. Yeah. <laughs> You're so, insane. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. My, my, my one was I was just walking around the corridor, but she, my mom didn't know I was sleepwalking. Yeah. And I was naked as well. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm walking around the corridor, and she keeps on saying my name. She's like, Alex, is that you? Alex, is that you? Yeah. And then the last Alex was just like loud. And bro, my ho- my heart was clutching <coughs> and I pissed on the floor now. Fucking hell. And then I was just like, oh shit. Like I've woken up naked and I'm like, oh naked. Shit. Bro, that's naked, what I, bro, yeah. that's what I'm thinking. I'm like, yeah. why are you? Because I went to bed naked. And why? I was crazy. Why? That's crazy. Why? why? I why? understand as a grown man why you're going to bed naked. Bro, it was mad hot. Why? It was mad nah, hot. Even then, it's mad like, hot. <laughs> boxes on top of the bed, nah. no sheets. Nah. Window it open. It was mad hot. Like, I don't feel like sleeping oh, naked is sleep more, unless you're science. married. <laughs> it's the only time you're allowed to sleep naked. Nah, the NFL wouldn't let us wouldn't let us look into OJ's brain, so we got to look into yours instead. Nah. 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 You nah. telling me you ain't, you ain't slept naked? Do you know nah. what is the problem? Nah. It's the one time you. Too vulnerable. No, no, the one way too vulnerable. The one time you do sleep naked, yeah, and you get rid of that that insecurity, yeah. Yeah. (laughs) You just feel so good. You end up peeing the fucking in front of your mum in the hallway, bro. What are you talking about? Sleeping naked is crazy. 
No. Oh, man. What else did That's I want to talk about? I wanted to talk about you. Me? Yeah, man. I've got a serious problem with you sport content creators, man. <laughs> Hey, I said it's got a problem. That video life. Moses made is so accurate, bro. Hey, well, I was I was gonna say Moses has found a quality like, gap in the market. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, it's so it's so accurate because I saw something. I think it was Lippy who tweeted it. Yeah, he was like, "Bro, who do these YouTube guys rate?" No, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah, you guys yeah. slander not you personally, but yeah, yeah, yeah. these YouTube brands slander everyone. So it's like, who do you like? Who's a good player then? Yeah, but no, yeah, you know what is? It's just fun to hate, bro. But here's what I mean. I hate. No, I hate rush like. I'm so irrational. I, I feel like we do this thing where every every single game is a referendum on a player. Yeah. So if we talk about Foden, for instance, mm. Foden had a bad Euros and he had a really bad Euros, mm. but now Foden, now apparently Foden is not, not a good player. It's an inquest. And it's, yeah. but it's an inquest, but yeah. it's like, like I'm I'm, I saw, I, I've seen I wasn't old enough to watch the game live. I've seen the game. I've watched the game. I saw Zidane get locked up by Paul Lambert in a, in a yeah, Champions League yeah, final. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, great, I'm not saying he's Zidane, but, but great players have bad games. 100%. Great players have bad tournaments. You know, that, that France bro, team people... in 2002 was full of great players. Facts. They got grouped. Do you know what like, it is? Get me, it happens, bro. Do you know what it is? It's like, we've taken the term hate watch too far. Yeah. We've gone too far with it. Like, bro. we're... Where we're literally, we're not hate watching a team, we yeah. hate watching a player. Yeah. Like every minute. Is... And football, football's tribalism. Yeah, There's yeah, only yeah, one yeah. player I hate watching, it's Richarlison. Other than that, I don't I really agree. care. Really. I, I'm with you. I, I love him really so much. I, I, you see, to this brother, I don't understand. I hate yeah, Richarlison yeah, I love him so, so much. much. He'd be liking all, all the special player, needs players. <laughs> <laughs> the one thing no, is, he, do this he thing needs where, love. He do this thing where every, every single, like, for instance, <laughs> Foden has a bad tournament. Mbappe has a bad tournament and now suddenly Mbappe's not the best player in the world and Foden's yeah. not this and it's like it doesn't really make any sense to but me no, but you get me I've got like little you know one. what it is though it's, I feel like everybody just wants the hottest takes yeah yeah, yeah 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 we live in an era of like I don't know whoever has the ahead of the curve take yeah. mm. everyone looks at it like oh yeah, Genius. you know Paul, you know Paul. Yeah, yeah. So if you said Foden was shit three years ago yeah. and you're able to quote tweet that tweet now yeah. after yeah, yeah, this yeah, year yeah. everyone's like yeah. Yo, he was a genius, yeah. you know? Just, but like, he's had the best three years like, of his like, life. It's like, bro, it's like uh, <laughs> earlier in the season on SDS, Lee Man must have said um, Foden's a luxury player. So six months, I just spent cooking him because yeah. Foden was doing player of the year, yeah. Yeah. killing out at City. Yeah. He's now spun the block and everyone's like, yo, you know what? You was a genius. Yeah. And that's all it is now. Football's become yeah. a, a game of... Gotcha. I was right, yeah. mm. you lot was wrong. Gotcha. Yeah, I gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. I told you lot, you lot yeah. didn't want to listen to me. Yeah. First they called me crazy, mm. now they understand. I've had this theory and I was saying that nobody has football knowledge because football is essentially art. Like, I could say... Not anymore, stop. Huh? <laughs> not anymore, no, no, stop. You know, no, but, but, no. Like, I, we could have a picture there I'd be like, man, look at the technique. Da, da, da. Be like, I don't like that technique. I think it's shit. Yeah. And it's the same with football where... You say, I don't know, there obviously there's difference between a shit player and a great player. Yeah. yeah. But then from times we're having debates about if, if Mbappe is any good, it's like, come on now. Yeah, we're yeah, just yeah. we're either just being very silly or we actually just don't know football because at the same time, if you say Mbappe is not any good, you're gonna go to the Euros and you're gonna point out everything to uh, um back your your fact. Yeah. And it's like but that's why nowadays I just like I just respect people's opinions. I don't yeah, I'm not gonna hate you for your opinion. I might debate back, but I ain't gonna take it personal. I think that's that's the thing. Is like with me, I'm just like everyone's got an opinion. Yeah, yeah. it don't matter if we have differing opinions. Mm, I mm. think nowadays though, it's like if you have a differing opinion or something that don't agree with mine, you don't know ball, yeah. or you just don't know anything. Yeah, and yeah. that's where I'm kind of like, well, we might as well just not even talk. Then. But like, that's well, the thing. Well, what's the point of discussion? But what's you know the point what? of dialogue? I hate. I hate. A lot. A lot of people don't even. A lot of people don't even really put in put in the like you probably watch you look you watch probably more football than ninety five percent of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who are watching doing these football takes. every day. Yeah. <laughs> I, listen, bro, like you see me when it comes to uh, football, whether it be any sport, you might know yeah. which best sport. And even for instance, right, I'm a big wrestling fan, for instance, yeah. and it's like when I'm I had a conversation every day. I'm naturally an argumentative person, so. When I see a bad take, I have to challenge you. Yeah, yeah. I, I have to. I have to going argue. Back and forth yeah. from, but then I was listening to a podcaster. <laughs> One of my favorite podcasts is yeah. a Western podcast, and he made a good point. He was like, when you're talking to these people about a medium, and you have to understand the people that you're talking to just aren't qualified. So it's like, he's got a daughter. He's like, if I ask my fr- my daughter what the best movie of all time is, yeah. she's going to say Frozen 2. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, she's yeah. only seen 20 movies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. of course to her, Frozen Limited. 2 is the best, because yeah, she's yeah, only yeah. seen 20 movies. Now, and someone she, like you... And she might not be wrong. Yeah, that's she what might, I'm saying. She but might someone, not be someone wrong. Someone like you who's seen... 
thousands of football games and hundreds of football games yeah. in just the last couple of years or whatever. Now they're baiting with someone who only watches compilations and stuff. Facts. It's like, of course, yeah, you're not talking the same language. Yeah, 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 you yeah. get me? Like, I'm not going to sit and argue with a six year old that the Godfather's better than Frozen 2. You just look stupid. You look crazy. And, and you know what? That's the part I feel <laughs> like, like I've gotten to in life now where yeah. I'm at that stage where I've seen certain footballers and now their sons yeah. are playing. I'm like, yeah. yo, I, I'm becoming an old head. I'm yeah. getting yeah. yeah. So there's, there's dudes on the internet yeah. who have only been watching ball since like 2010, yeah. 2012. If that, their yeah, first if memory that. is drug by lifting the Champions yeah. League and I'm like yo you can't be getting into heated back and forth yeah. with brothers like this it's like you know what yeah. if they've got an opinion let them have it that's the thing like, on Twitter you don't know who you're arguing with yeah, yeah. You like, you don't, then sometimes you you ever argued with accounts so much yeah like you don't even follow each other but you see them on the time like yeah this nigga I hate like yeah, it's like yeah. walking past someone in the room yeah. like, like you know you know his stupid Bro, um, his I, meme his meme um, I swear to you I'm <laughs> sure there's niggas like that who walk past you every day they see me yeah and they're like that Tottenham motherfucker. Because I know there's bare Arsenal fans that follow me. Yeah. Bare Arsenal. Just to, just for that moment of, I'm going to get this nigga. I'm going to get him back. But they see me and they don't say nothing, bro. I'm like, yo. There was a time I was in um I was in Brothers and then someone mistaken... Mistake, <laughs> they, put, they, they thought I was too much to I'm crying. Bro, this has happened to me before. So I'm like, please, <laughs> no, no. So I'm like, I'm, I got bare meat in my hands. <laughs> and niggas ask me, and I'm like, bro, do I look like I want to talk bull? Like, yeah. <laughs> and trying to eat this bullies and everything. Yeah, bro. Me, bro. Chill on me, man. <laughs> but nah, it was like, come on, man. Like, just leave me alone. Yeah. At the same time, um, in Brothers Again, and the guy was like, ah, oh, like, oh, you're the, you're the guy. And now I have to ask, like, what do you mean? He was like, you're the, you're the one with the podcast. And I was like, what podcast? <laughs> <laughs> and like, if the FCM or SCS comes out. Hey, no. <laughs> but then he was like, nah, I listen to AOT. And I was yeah. like, finally, yeah. so <laughs> Do you know what? I've, I, recently, I've had bare people approach me about the podcast. Yeah, it's, like, it, it is. When I was in Paris, I had bare people approach me. Yeah. Do you know what is? I get more love outside of London. Yeah. Like, it's yeah. it's weird. Like, because yeah. I think London is as well, is, we're just going to walk past. Yeah, everywhere. niggas are haters in London. Yeah. Facts. Yeah. But then, um, but you saw the YouTube comment when the bread was like, I'm the title is at the, um, in the airport. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was, yeah, 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 yeah. I, was with, I was with Jake, innit? You know Jake. Yeah, really? yeah, 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 yeah. I was with Jake and our other guy, Leo. We were walking, it was before our flight, so we were just going into Spoons to get something to drink. And the bread tapped me on the shoulder. It was like a young, light skinned boy. He's like, bro, another part. I was like, oh shit, my nigga, like, yeah, yeah, crazy yeah, yeah. when, like, you're not in ends. And people are, you get me? My, right? my one economy, was, yeah. I was two weeks ago, I was at my local co- uh, local coffee shop, but it's an Albanian mm. coffee shop. Mm. So it's like 99% Albanians, yeah. And the you said you got an Albanian pass like that. Hey, yeah. and now, you know, the noise, yeah. That's like level one. There's a serious Albanian yeah, yeah, yeah. little, like, I wouldn't even step to. Because you were last summer to get yeah, your pass. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. But then, you you... I, nah, nah, I was there. your pass <laughs> Hey, I'm not going. I, Moses went there the other day. What's your Albanian women count? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa, what are they doing now? What are they doing? What are they doing? <laughs> next topic. Next topic. <laughs> He's finished. <laughs> next topic. Next topic. Next topic. Next topic. He's finished. <laughs> He's made, finished. It, made it. Made it. Made <laughs> <laughs> it. Uh, uh, sorry, that? sorry. I'm for a spanner in the works. I'm for a spanner in the works. Sorry, sorry. I remember when I was in school. There oh. was one one babe called in Sweden. She had the fattest back, man. Oh, like, man. but now yeah, back to it. Then um. Um, guy making my coffee, some Albanian fella. Yeah. I know he ain't got no papers, but he's a real one. Bro, he was like, man, I know he's from somewhere. And he was like, ah, oh, the podcast. So he's like, I love it. Yeah. And I was like, nigga, he can barely speak English and he's tapping in. And I was like, man, I got, like, I got mm. big love for Albanians. Yeah, I've always, I've always. Now, nah, bro, yeah, you, yeah. you man's thing definitely flying, especially on TikTok as well. Yeah. Because like, I remember there was like this, some girl I was chatting to and she was like, where have I seen you before? And I was like, I don't know, I do, I do mm. like a bunch of stuff. And she's like, no, nah, I've seen you on a podcast. And I'm thinking, <laughs> she's going to bring up my Sky Sports. Yeah. Kids, <laughs> like, we, me, me and Qatar, you know, interview that da- 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 or something. I was like, she goes, is this you on Apes on Tape? And it was me and him talking about some fuck shit. I can't even remember. Yeah, and I was yeah. just like, of all the podcasts, was it, was it, was it, was it to see you. Yes, yeah, yeah, it was yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, I didn't even yeah. want to say it, but it was yeah. that one. And I was like, uh, yeah, 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 that was me. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I was dude. like, couldn't even beat the allegations. But, or but shit was that, too that, that reminds me, the problem of having you sports <laughs> content yeah. creators, yeah. 
Bro, we're talking about before the pods. <laughs> like, like when I find like certain women following through and yeah. Leah's, yeah. Yo. <laughs> Do you know how, how much it pisses me off? There was one one babe tweeted that and like, oh like Fuad's my favourite on STS or some shit, yeah. And like, I really liked her as well. Yo, <laughs> do you like, know what's so I'm funny? Like... <laughs> That's the honest thing, is like there we I I didn't even realise there was this many like girls that watch like yeah. podcasts and yeah. stuff like that. So it's like sometimes you just see these requests and things like that and then it's mm-hmm. like what's funny is it's like I don't pay no mind to it but then someone will message me and be like yo how you know this girl like, yeah, I, don't know. I, I don't know bro but, but do you just keep liking your tweets bro <laughs> I saw her screenshot and post it on IG I said oh cross promotion I said yes hey, I, I remember one babe one babe posted uh, Liaz I was like hey, <laughs> nah don't kill me <laughs> I was so mad. <laughs> See the register. What he's got to do in there is pick the pockets of space between the half space. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, yeah, bitch, what do you understand about hey, this? No, no, the funniest video of Leah's yet. Oh, man, I think it was you lot's SDS, like Christmas dinner or something. Yeah. And this nigga fully took it, talking about bull, like. <laughs> no, we was out for we was out for uh, after Ramadan. It was yeah, deep. yeah. We was going for like an Eid meal break. Niggas no, were arguing. Fast. Yeah, niggas Bro, were arguing over what wolves. At, like, a nice restaurant. Man, them have all come, you know. Brotherhood. Yeah. Man, I'm a full on debating Man United season. Oh, I just said, dude. nah, this is unreal. Yeah. Bro. Unreal. Big up, Leas, man. Nah, man. Nah, big him up, man. Right now, but shout out to you. You need to get involved in the football <laughs> sessions. Oh, yeah. uh, he is my nigga, but the last time I played ball with that, bro. <laughs> he's, nah, he's nice, man. Well, no, he's good. He's good yeah. at football. But the last session I played with him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lord have mercy. It's not looking good. Lord have mercy. Hey. Lord have mercy. Oh. I remember one time I seen him tweeted about someone taking too long on the ball. I said, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Nah, that would kill me. Do you know the funniest one was? Last, said, last year we was doing like a lot of summer sessions and I remember he was cooking Anthony. And I remember after the, after one of the sessions, I was like, bro, you know who you remind me of, bro? <laughs> no, bro. You play just <laughs> like Anthony. Bare, you bare, it, bare bro. pointless turns. Like, you, you lost it. it. No, I can't lie, you might, I, 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 I need to find a regular football session. I don't yeah, play yeah. football often enough. I haven't, yeah. I haven't, the last time I played was with you, I had a stinker. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my days! What the the DR Cup game? Yeah, 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 bro. That's probably like the last nah, time. That, I was, that was the funniest shit. They they took me off because they thought I was gonna get sent off. Yeah, and yeah. brought Alex on. Thinking bro, it was like, Ryan. oh, same hair, like for like swap. Yeah. Bro, do you know what it is? Yeah, <laughs> the way he got cooked. Yeah, bro, do you know what it is? Yeah, he I made over to the sideline like, help, uh, please. No, nah, there was one point. Yeah, the guy went past me, and I was like, fuck, <laughs> like you know, he just got on. Yeah, bro, the way I had to track back and make yeah. a last. It, Challenge it, yeah. bro. And then I was, like, I was like, I was like, that's my energy gone. Like I was yeah. saving it for something special. Yeah. Then I think it was the point. The ball came over my head. Yeah, and I've gone to header it. I was like, I'm not reaching this. So I was like, I've done this before. Let it come over my head, and I'm bring it down. And it come over my head, and I'm about to bring it down, and the guys nicked it from me in mid air. And then I was like, oh no. You know, when the guy's through and go, yeah. and you're like, oh no. <laughs> no. I've just come I've just come on for Fuad, yeah. Fuad's having the game no. of his life. Yeah. And I'm like, oh no. And then the funniest thing <laughs> is, yeah, the way I got subbed was crazy, yeah. Cause I'm just there, like, I rebuild boys, yeah. And Fuad just creeps up from behind me, like, he was on the bench. Yeah. Just tapped my shoulder, and he was like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, like, it was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta go, bro. Like, bro. It's not your day today, bro. Bro, I saw this shit in real yeah, time, yeah, I swear to like, you. You, you know what you can see? You gotta put man out of his misery. Cuz, like, you know what you can see? He wanted to be put out of his yeah, misery, yeah. bro. But then, do you know what it is, yeah? It's an annoying thing, because we had so many players, and everyone was like, oh, where'd you lot play? And it's full of just, like, CDMs and sentiments. And I was like, bro, Put me in CDM with no responsibility and let me drive and like stay up there and just be lazy. <laughs> and then and then it was like, ah, you kind of big centre back. I'm like, I don't play. I hate. I hate. I can play centre back <laughs> at like seven aside, yeah. but eleven aside. Bro, hey, two track. You gotta do a balls over the top. Of yeah, the pitch was yeah. too big, bro. Too big, man. You. And the noise, it was like it was like thirty two degrees that day. Oh, it was hot, bro. Bro, hey, do <laughs> you know what's the funniest moment? As well? I remember, abs. Hey, all right. The vid- Bro, Abs picks up picks up the ball from halfway line, yeah. So he's playing right back, <laughs> and he's dro- he drove about fifteen yards, and he's just had that fuck it ball moment, yeah. and he's hit a shot. You know when you shoot and both your feet are off the air, so he's shot, both feet are off the air, 
Bro, he was like the Michael Jordan side. Oh <laughs> he was like the Jordan God. side. Bro, the ball went mad. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Oh man, nah, bro. You don't understand how rim free that lives in my head, bro. <laughs> Both feet off the ground, yeah. And this shit, you know when it does a Roberto Carlos yeah, spin, yeah, yeah. but it's oh, nowhere near. To, it went corner flag and then out for a throw. Bro, I'm <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> and you know what it was? It was it was his face afterwards. <laughs> he just smiled. Which I just jumped back. Um, NSG. Oh, uh, that's fucking funny. Oh man, I've got <laughs> nah. I've got the picture. I actually, actually bought one of them in, um, in Paris. Which one was it? Uh, probably it was, Mojo. It was the one. Yeah, I think it was Mojo. The one that was um, on the podcast when I was in there that time. He's cool. Show me my love. Still, we're just chopping up. Right, I've got the video, man. I've got the video. Let me see this shit. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you got to say that as a clip somewhere yeah. in the video, bro. bro Damn, is, no, this, no, is, is this free spray? Oh, that man. Is crazy. No. Oh, oh my God. That game was crazy. comedy, bro. I'm telling you, you had nines and centre mid. Oh, <laughs> <okay>. <laughs> bro, am I lying? Nines and centre mid, yeah. Doing the craziest half turns. Bro, niggas had to drag nines up. Yeah. <laughs> niggas, <laughs> nines was having a stinker that day, yeah. yeah. And then... I uh, forgot who was managing us. Uh, um, it was Expressions and Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Expressions is like, nah, nine, nah, you're taking a piss, come yeah. off the pitch. Yeah. And he's like, he's like, nah, blood, I'm a ball out. Blood. And he's like, bro, like we're actually chasing the game now, yeah. yeah? And um, KG had to run on the pitch and pick him up yeah. and take him off. Like, it was, nah, like, it, was it was too <laughs> funny because I know man was scared to take yeah, him off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he came with bare goons as well. Yeah. Yeah. On the team. It got to so, the way, like first half, yeah. That I call like nines has to play in yeah, it. Yeah, 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 <laughs> like yeah. he's come out a long way, and then um, everyone's like, "Nah, man, take him off." And, and everyone's like, "Who's gonna tell him?" <laughs> <laughs> Not me, innit? <laughs> no, I, but that's the main reason. So he's playing in the middle, yeah. yeah. And like, even for like me, there are bare other people playing in the middle. I was like, "Bro, nines is playing in the middle," and like, whenever he wants to come on, he's gonna come on. Yeah. Like, and I don't want to get into that debate where like someone's like, "Oh, come off for nines," and I don't want to be arguing. Now nah, I'm. Yeah. Back to back with hood niggas. <laughs> See you after the game, big man. <laughs> yeah. hey. You're on my team. <laughs> but uh, there's one question I wanted to, to ask you. There's a lot of things been going on, yeah, and um, I ain't gonna bring it up, but I wanted to know, yeah, how it feels being a Muslim in the limelight, like in the content creation limelight, where people are just like often looking at you. Oh, you're a Muslim. You shouldn't be doing this. Shouldn't be doing that. I think in as any Muslim, you're always kind of judged to the highest degree, I think. And I think even when you look at kind of over the past couple of months, the amount of situations that have been kind of been where, I don't know, it's 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 just normal in my eyes how, how you're kind of judged because I feel like as a Muslim, you, you hold yourself to a high standard essentially. Mm. And I think anytime people see you maybe not practicing the way you should yeah. be or not acting how you should be, if there's one thing people love is to to check you and remind yeah, you, hey, yeah, yeah. brother, but that's these fix up type of things. You know what I mean? Like my mate, yeah. Like, look at, the whole thing with chunks is crazy. And listen, this is I'm not Muslim, and yeah. it's not for me to speak on what the values are in Islam. Mm. But I just kind of feel a bit sorry for I don't know chunks personally. Obviously, yeah. I know a lot of chunks. Yeah, people, yeah, yeah. But I don't know him personally. From what I've seen, it just feels like he can't catch a break. No. Yeah. He practices it. He doesn't practice the way they want him to. The way he think they think he should. They get onto him. The nigga, he does it? The nigga, they say it's tokenism. Yeah. The nigga gave then up music. He, he he he's doing music. Oh, you shouldn't be doing music. He so stops gives doing it. it. Yeah. Oh, you're only not doing it because we told yeah. you not to. Yeah. He finds this woman. He gets married. Whatever. And they're posting they everywhere post and stuff. It and it's like yeah. it's just it's just a bit unfair. Like, even with the whole thing where the only thing where I I kind of said okay he that was on him was the Lil Nas X thing. Yeah. He should have had the force to yeah, see yeah, that yeah, coming yeah, because yeah. you know, you should have your finger on the pulse <coughs> with the reasons why the Muslim community don't mm, like Lil Nas X. Yeah. And obviously I get it, you're a grown man, you can move however. Same way, you kind of have to be sensible towards these things. It's just yeah. the, it's the nature of the beast of being in the limelight. But when I'm a man, I ask him, why is the Khanis in your bedroom? I said, I'm sorry, that's a hilarious question. <laughs> ask him, man, why is the Khanis in your bedroom? It's crazy. <laughs> that what's, is what's, crazy. What's he supposed to say? <laughs> How do you answer that question? You can't, bro. But it's one of them ones where it's, I do feel sorry for him, and I do feel a lot of the time he gets a real deal pause mm -hmm. because a lot even of the time with chunks is damned if you do, damned if you don't. Yeah, but even like Harry Panero gets a yeah. lot of it. Yeah, but yeah. when you look at in terms of like Muslims in the UK content creation space, 
he might be the most prominent. He is. Yeah, more he, one is one. he is the most prominent. He, he, he's and, and he's I think, and I think that's but the I thing, though. There isn't, there though. isn't many. Yeah. There yeah, isn't yeah. many that have come before that. There isn't yeah. even many since, if you like. There, there yeah. probably have been more since, yeah. but it's a case of, I think, people always look at it and it's like, all right, don't 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 get too Hollywood now. Don't get yeah. too yeah. big time. And, yeah. and I, the thing I always say and the way I look at it is, as long as I feel like I'm doing right by Allah, as long yeah. as I feel yeah. like I'm practicing it the way I've been raised and taught, sure. It's your own well, relationship. I don't, I don't at the end care of the day, what yeah. some Twitter nerd thinks or, or yeah. what their opinion is or whatever. But in his situation, because I think he's so big, and especially when it comes to things like wedding and you're fucking up, like actual things that are happening in lifetime, yeah. it's it's a it's a crazy situation. And yeah. sometimes I even like Sharky, who I'm very close with. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I see the shit kind of he gets put through, and it's like yeah. you can't even be yourself at yeah. times without being told, "Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Like, yeah. why are you dancing for? That's some gay shit." And yeah. it's like. Bro, what, man yeah. can't even have a laugh and a dance yeah. almost. Like, like they were onto chunks because there was black bears at his wedding, bro. The, the, hey, listen. You're, you know you're I mean? talking to Sorry, a, Sma- a Somali yeah. with dreads, bro. They've so, been telling me, yeah, the, the Jarer from Atlanta. That, that's someone said, me on Twitter. Someone said the Jarer from Vacation, <laughs> yeah. I said, I said, the situation's not funny, <laughs> but what you just said, my friend, I'm crying. The who? Jarer from Even the... Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> bro, I'm telling you, even like just having this hair gets me yeah. cooked. Oh, a Somali, no, no, Soma- that, Somali with bro, dreads. Somali dreads. Is man, crazy. man, I, with <laughs> Somali with dreads. Oh, I just be laughing. I, I, I'm gonna be real with you, yeah. I was, I was talking, <laughs> I was talking to my boy the other day. I said, we we've, we've batched up the worst Somalis ever. This era, <laughs> I said, the Somalis doing coke. <laughs> the Somalis drinking. <laughs> There's. <laughs> Somalis with dreads. <laughs> Somalis with dreads. Hey, dreads is just a hairstyle, man. Come on. <laughs> nah, nah. So, we lost the Somali recipes, man. Nah. They're like the, the salami Somalis, bro. Like, <laughs> That's a Somali Somali. Oh, my God. Bro, bro if I see a, a Somali in pork, I'm going to lose it. The world's ending. That's yeah. that's my last straw. That's the last straw. <laughs> All these other things, I can low-key accept it, but pork is where I draw the line. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, can I can't accept like the... pork. I'm putting my foot down. I ain't yeah. even seen that one. That's the line. Yeah, I, I, ain't I ain't seen that one. Yeah, I haven't I... seen it either. <laughs> <laughs> pork is my life. Shut shut but but, but the, the thing is, yeah, I was, uh, bro. I think there was one guy in, in the comments, yeah. He was like, "This story's cap." Um, I was talking about getting beaten up by some Somalis, yeah. and he was like, "This story's cap because Somalis don't drink." I said, "Brother, you need to come to the UK because we're batching up some yeah. of the worst. Yeah. Like these niggas, they be drinking, <laughs> they be out drinking everyone." But even so, man. But I got, I got much love. I think. Uh, the Somali women, a hey, top five for me, man. Top five mm. for me. That's that's where I first uh, found love in like the whole East Africa. I said, wow, man, I need to take my talents there. I need to find. Hey, they South don't S- want you. Oh, what South Sudan? Nah. Huh? That's the, that, that's the. I think I think you're right there. It's like the East Africans don't want. Yeah. Them alone. East Africans stick to East Africans, man. I can't lie to you. I, My rap sheet the, says the, different. The, oh, worry. Some scraps get left nah. over. <laughs> Y'all can have nah. the scraps. Nah, man. Get, is Uganda um, East Africa? Uh, Southeast. Yeah, yeah. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take. But the, the new Somali women, Jesus Christ, man. My I think. Father. I think. I think that's the thing. It's like with um, even like Somali culture, you're seeing almost like a wave of a new generation. Where like mm. I feel like twenty years ago. You barely saw Somali girls even without their headscarf, without their yeah, jab. That's like since what I call like the IG era. Now mm. it's like you're lucky if you see some of them with the headscarves. Yeah, you know what yeah. I mean? It's like you see tight body dress on the IG. It's like yeah. some trying to be IG models and things. Like that. And I think it's just a generational mm. thing. Do you it's know a what generation I mean? Yeah, thing, yeah. Yeah. Like with me, like my first experience, uh, I think I was like 20. So I was chatting to this Somali girl and she was like really cool and yeah. we've known each other for time, but she always had a headscarf on. And I was like, Raw, like she came around my yard and she backed off, mm. and I was like, raw, like me being quite young, I was like, I f- like you ain't supposed to be doing this. I ain't supposed to be see seeing your hair, yeah. and she was like, yeah, can get away with it. And then ever since it's growing up, it was just like, I ain't seen not, I'm not seeing much headscarves anymore. Yeah. Like back in school days, pure headscarves everywhere, everywhere. But I think yeah, it's definitely like a generation thing where everyone's yeah. just, I know, becoming. I'd say becoming themselves or having their own relationship with, with Bro, God, maybe. Just, I feel like it's just being raised in the West and just yeah. kind of in that more liberal yeah. like, environment. Like, like I said, I ain't Muslim, but I feel like for me, with religion in general, as long as you kind of just get right with God yeah. and you, you yeah. have your own your own kind of relationship with God. Uh, but there's only, there's one time when um, it was the Muslims and the Somalis, they showed themselves to me 
when I made that tweet about the Muslim couples. Oh, they yeah, don't, don't, yeah, don't play. Yeah, no, no, no. no. The assumptions <laughs> they don't play, <laughs> bro, bro. Even this whole conversation, I'm like, <laughs> bro, the whole, bro. Uh, no, I'm too too much. no, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, no. But the thing is, yeah, I was right. <laughs> I wasn't saying I was right. I had, I asked a question. I was. I asked why do Muslim couples get married so quickly? But the thing you have to understand is different when you ask the question. Yeah. No, but I'm still asking the question. No, have, but it's who's asking the, it. Are you, are you asking it from an educational standpoint to learn? Or are you asking it from a? I'm making a statement. <laughs> I'm making. I'm making a word, statement. Where to Josh to be an antagonist? Yeah. No, but yeah. I, <laughs> no, but I was. I was. Um, I was making like a statement like about marriage and like lust. Mm. Like it's not. It, it, not much is gonna come from it, and then. But then um, that's when uh, Father Albozo came out, um, Fatherless Alfonso. Mm. I was getting cooked, and then it got crazy when um, um, the whole uh, Jarea thing. Fatherless was... Alfonso is so Bro, funny, bro. I didn't know what a Jarea was. I was like, oh, this is a wavy name. Don't tell me that Jarea is not a, a wavy, like. It's not. It sounds no. wavy, bro. No, it doesn't. Uh, bro. But then I didn't know what it was. So it like... sounds like Jaleel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jamal, Jamal, <laughs> Jarea. I remember when Muslim Twitter cooked me and I couldn't believe I got cooked for this. I was having a back and forth with some rare. And then he said something and I was like, yeah, but like, I was like, cool. I was like, my son will punch your son up yeah. and he won't be anti-Semitic or racist or whatever. And I got cooked for it. Oh my God. I was like, my son's not going to be anti-Semitic or homophobic or racist. Yeah. Niggas was cooking me. <laughs> hey man, listen. No, we're going... Bro, I got cooked. Yeah. I got like 200 cool teeth on my head. Yeah. But, uh, I was like, all right, God damn, nigga. My, my one was more... Um, yeah, the guys were really telling me to kill myself. I was like, calm down, calm down, calm Bro, down, calm down. It's, it's like a hive mind. Right? Yeah. yeah. And that's how it is on Twitter anyway. Yeah. It's like once people start seeing... A lot of people don't once, think for themselves. Once a couple of people see you getting kicks, like, yeah. hold on, let me get yeah. my licks in as it's well, like, bro. It's like every so often I get someone DMing me, like, take that flag out your name now, yeah? No, take it out your name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you, you abusing me and saying, <laughs> yo, if you had gave me the pass, I'm like, bro, I'm from the North, that ain't even my flag, bro. <laughs> bro, bro. Bro, the funniest thing, I was, I was at, um, oh, I forgot the place, but um, I was all kicking ball, and then some guy stopped me, yeah, grabbed me on my shoulder. He was like, Nah, having that. He, he was like, "Why is the flag in your name?" I was like, "It started off as a joke, but now, now when people like like get angry about it, <coughs> I'm gonna do it because that's like my character." You know. And then um, he was just like, "Man," he shook his head, and he, um, I think he said something about you and your dress. I thought. My, my dreads always get thrown in some way, somehow. I'm like, at some point, yo. Uh, when you nah, get... Do you know what the worst thing is? is I, I, earlier in the year, I remember I was thinking, yo, I should cut it. I've had like three years of growth. Yeah. Mm. And then I remember they start. I tweeted on when Arsenal lost the title. Yeah. I went to the City Spurs game. But you know, like, oh, Spurs yeah, yeah, fans yeah, yeah, yeah. were Loki hoping Spurs yeah, yeah, yeah. The amount of Arsenal fans that was like this dusty, <laughs> jaded, <laughs> dreaded. And I went, you know what? Our principle now, I'm dusty. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that's the thing. Like, <laughs> nah, now I'm just keeping it. Just, just, just to piss just, you niggas off, bro. Just to annoy niggas. You got you to do that. But at the same time, uh, you go into the tunnel cave. It was so funny to me. <laughs> it's like he snuck in. <laughs> You know what he had the glasses and the moustache? No. The glasses and the moustache. You know what it is? Do it is, like, if we being, like, the most, like, prominent, like, Tottenham supporter, like, on socials, yeah, we don't have much representation. And this nigga still got sneaking. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, man, Tottenham fan base is a very weird one, bro. I'm sure they don't even like me, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, no, my brother fucks with you. My oh, brother, yeah. yeah, my brother, um, he was like, oh, what, um, this was like a year ago. He was like, why who had them making his own things anymore? I was like, oh, he's um, doing like the podcast. Uh, yeah, with man, I'll be on every Cause other Because like, my, my brother watches like like football content. Like, yeah. You can talk ball with my brother. like, But you know when it's straight ball and a little bit of banner, but yeah, he will... He's like Atlas. He will, he will, he will debate you. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. If he, yeah. Hear, if you're chilling and he hears something wrong, slightly wrong, he was just like, you know, you know, the nigga at the barbecue. He's just like, he's just like fully activated, trying to get into the conversation. Oh, we know all about niggas at barbecues that are activated. Like, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> but me and Alex almost got, bro. Imagine right, we're at barbecue, yeah. And there's a oh, bread. Is this a Reams' Freak Nick? Yeah, Reams' Freak Nick. What was he even going to say? <laughs> right, when I saw that hashtag, well, I was so dying. So we're at the Freak Nick, yeah. <laughs> bread's bugging out. Oh. One of the breads is bugging. Yeah. Saying all this and bum, clark this, clark that. Yeah, bugging yeah, 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 out. Yeah, yeah. But he's bugging on these, like, breads. So he's, like, he's, he's bugging on like, Reams' like, family. There's family. Like a group yeah, of, like, yeah, yeah. seven of them. 
but the man them were all standing there, but he's standing with the man them. Yeah. Now he's bugging out on them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he's spudding us. Bro, so like, you know, like, so, so you know, what? like, he's, so, group over there, yeah. and he's here, and our group's here. Yeah. But we're not like on some war thing, but he's bugging out now in the middle. He's just on a, he's a solo, solo nomad. Yeah, he's yeah, a nomad. Yeah, yeah. He's a nomad at this point. He's bugging out. He's barking, barking. And he's come over to us, and I'm in conversation. And he's kind of like spudding everyone running low. Yeah. And he's still chatting enough crud. And I'm like, hold on, what's going on? <laughs> and then I'm thinking, nah, you ain't going to come over here and have niggas thinking yeah, you're yeah, with yeah. us. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it got to the point, yeah, and like an hour later. Bro, imagine if I did, I got to yeah. tell this bit. I got to tell, I have to yeah. tell this bit. Imagine the man, them, not me, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The man, them were doing um, balloons, innit? Yeah. With his hella canisters and that. A Somali you know the there, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever they're called, the gas, the, the, yeah, the canisters. Yeah, yeah the yeah, big yeah. one. So he's bugging out still. He's picked one of them up. Frozen. Alex bro. has snatched it out of his hand I so said, quick. Bro, he's, he's, he's like picked it up and he's barking off now. Yeah. And bro. I've seen it. Yeah. I said, you've gone too far. Yeah, Yoink. Yeah. And I just dashed it away. Yeah. And I was just like, bro, we're not bro. doing this. Yeah, I'm yeah, like, yeah, Alex yeah, is the voice yeah. of reason. Yeah, you're bugging not, out. You're, you're fucked. You're, you're bugging finished. out. If Alex yeah. is the voice of reason. You're bugging no, out. You've got the the funniest moment is when um, uh, one man came on, came on, yeah, and he's singing it. He's like, one man, to my boom, boom, yeah. And then everyone, t- so the guys he's not fucking with, yo, Batty man. Hey, <laughs> 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 don't kill me. They're like, fish, <laughs> Batty man. <laughs> and then, and then, oh my God. <laughs> and then, you know, <laughs> like, getting that cool, yeah, his, his back it was up against the wall. Yeah. And I, bro, I was like, this guy, no, like, let me explain <laughs> to you what kind of guy he was. Like, you know them yardies, yeah, with two teeth, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was she one here, one there, <laughs> bro. He, gold, bro. one each gum. And like, you know, like, if you go to the yardie party, you're gonna get <laughs> one yardie just been drinking for four, but bro, he was burst at six. I'm sure he yeah. burst when we arrived. Yeah, yeah we yeah, got there yeah. six and he was burst. And like, you know the ones where he's next to the DJ trying to give the DJ tips, yeah? yeah? yeah. I was like, this guy's burst. And like two hours later, bro, he wasn't inside anymore. <laughs> Niggas just told him, like, if you want to stay here, go outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> bro, I couldn't... Ventilate, bro. <laughs> couldn't believe it, man. Hey, like, that's nuts. But now, how's your summer been, though? Bro, I can't lie to you. It's been up. a chilled summer. Damn. This one. Uh, I was trying to go away, but... Vacation? Like, fuck that, man. Nah. Vacation, man. No vacation. That was two two times ago when yeah. I come on here. Yeah. <laughs> no, no more. No. I learned no. my lesson from that relationship. I was like, no, no mas. <laughs> Let me save myself that money, no, man. man. I might, I might no, need, I might, I might need one soon as well. But where else you been? Like bay. A little vacation. No, I'm, I'm, I'm tied up now. Shit's exhausting, bro. Yeah, man. Mentally, physically. No, I hear it. I can't be nah, doing that. I've got, I've got energy for a woman now, bro. I'm, I'm. For what time? I'm thirty plus now, man. It's. Marriage, what are we doing? That's it. But does it get like that? Thirty plus, yeah, though? bro, man. I I'm, feel like it, I tired, feel like it man. is like it's just like talk to someone, um, baby. Talk, marriage. talk about what, bro? Tell me where you're from. Tell me your trauma. Mm-hmm. Let's get to it. That's crazy. That's why it's, I, this because it's because business, isn't it? yeah. at, at, the this, the at this age, it's like well, I know you're de- you got some baggage. Just let's get to that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. but I just say uh, that's what I always said. Yeah, if if. I go into a long relationship now. Say mm. I come out of a relationship at 33. I think I'm finished. I think I'm done with women. Yeah. Because like, I've got... I've, I think I'll have nothing left. I'll have no more small talk, no more getting to know someone. It'll just Welcome. be like, Welcome. I'm with you because I potentially want a baby in two years. I'm going to mm. keep it a stack. Like, and I feel like women do that a lot now. Like When they turn 31. When women turn 31... Like that dating experience is not fun. Thirty one, bro. Try twenty seven. I would nah, say. Nah, nah, nah. I'd say once. I've, once I've seven, that late twenties is once, fun. Uh, I feel like I don't know. I feel like once it gets to like late twenties, it's like only serious candidates only, please, yeah. type of thing. But with no, nah, but like with like late twenties, it's like alright, cool. We can still get to know each other. But like mm. with the thirty plus, it's like now, like. It's, I want kids now. Yeah, it's like, yeah, tell me yeah. your 10-year business plan. It's like, bro, ooh, ooh. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm just vibing right now. But yeah, nah, I've, I've, I think I was like, when I was like, I was doing it when I was like 23, 24. Okay. I don't know why I love an older woman though. I love 
I don't know. How much older? A good six, seven years older. Like, I, I think just, one uh, of my first experiences was with her. Uh, I was, I think I was like 18. She was like you? mid 40s. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> that doesn't sound she very... She took advantage of you, bro. Yeah, bro. I, I liked it. Yeah. You could say she, she took advantage of yeah. me, but I... Because she did. I liked it. Mm. Don't put trauma on me. Don't put trauma on me. I was. We need to unpack that one episode. Yeah, yeah, but no, it was crazy though because a lot of his personality. It was um, <laughs> it was in it was in Cyprus and she kept on following me around. You know when a woman's man marking you. Yeah. And then um, she was showing me, bro. Her son was a big you like her son oh. was like thirteen, forty. You know, you know when a son's a big man. Yeah. And it was like, and I was like, bro, he's only like four years younger. I just yeah. remember something when I think it was you. Off when you went DR last year, there, there was a similar incident like this. The old, la- old lady heat mapping me, and I remember him posting bro, it on the stories. Bro, and I was like, Yo. DR, DR <laughs> yeah. is crazy because why am I in the shower? Yeah, cleaning lady comes in, and the showers is just like shower, no door. Yeah, and then um, I'm just there naked, and she comes in now, and then huh, and then comes in again and just opens the door. Like, so she was. Saw me naked, was like, oh, I went like this, and she just opened the door. And I was like, uh, just continue. No, I just continued. And then she was like, oh, Dios mío. She's like, Dios mío. That's it, 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 that's um, I'm getting changed now. She's but she's rushing me to get out to yeah. check out. So I'm just there in my swimming shorts. So I've backed off my swimming shorts. Yeah, and I realized she's. I'm so comfy with her. Like she's just there now. Yeah. I'm like, all right, cool. So I'm putting on, and now she's talking to me, and she's talking to me like this. Like she's recording me on the slide now. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, this is getting a little weird. <laughs> it's getting a little weird. Yeah, yeah. yeah and yeah. um, bro, she was on Facetime to a. Uh, uh, she said uh, uh, her niece mm-hmm. oh, so yeah yeah, yeah. So, so her niece and then um, I'm looking over and then it's like she's bare friendly um, she took my number down um, the old one and then we was chatting for like two weeks afterwards well, not not chatting I was just checking up on her man I gave her I gave her $50 tip oh, I, I knew it yeah I gave her $50 tip as well and she gave me like two bottles of champagne you know the cheap champagne yeah, champagne yeah. you're getting that the little four four dollar ones yeah I was like thanks babe but yeah she was a real one man I w- I would have smoked it. I'm gonna be real with you. I would have smoked her if <laughs> if it was there on the plate. I would have smoked it. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. I don't doubt you at all. I don't, all. I don't, I don't, doubt, you at all. I don't doubt you I at all. <laughs> <laughs> I tell I tell my I tell my girl this. <laughs> I was like, cause oh yeah, because I met her there. I met my girl there. So like, oh. we was always busting jokes that she wants me, and I was like, no, she's dead serious, and like I would. How long have you been with your girl now? Oh. I'm not doing timeline. Uh, no, we don't want to incriminate him. Because himself. there's always the. You're gonna jam him up, when, man. Yeah, it's my bad. Jam my, him my up. fault, OG. But yeah, it's been a long time. Yeah, yeah, it's been yeah, yeah, yeah it's been yeah. a very it's been long. A minute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Same kids, kids in. We're we're, we're nearly hitting three years. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time we've been doing this podcast. <laughs> Let's wrap this up, man. Hey, cool, man. Uh, 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 this is well, episode ninety something, I believe. Seven, I think you said. Uh, yeah, or ninety eight. Shit, it might be because I'm um, putting out the one with Moses today on the Patreon. All right, cool. 90-something. And then next week, we should be with your guys making a 99. And then... Oh, the shit, hun- yeah, of course, yeah. yeah the, hundred, course. the 100 button. That's yeah. going to be um, it's gonna be a movie, man. Yeah. Hopefully. But anyways... Yeah, we're going to have... We're going to have... Well, actually, let me not confirm. I'll tell you to double check with him. But we should have, we should have a very special guest on next yeah. time. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I'm going to see him on Saturday, so... All right, cool, cool. You want, you want to say anything? No. Always a pleasure being on, bro. Uh, yeah, big man. up for that. Hopefully they don't come after me after this one. <laughs> <laughs> big up for that. Show them your socks. Hey, come on, man. Big up the brand. Hey, NSLB. NSLB. You know where it is, Big man. up NSLB. Big up 99 by JMS. Come on, man. You niggas, up, see, you talk, niggas man. are fashion oh, niggas. Man. Chill, man. Let me finish, <laughs> man. Oh, God. Big up 99 nice. by JMS. Big up Talk Nice. Come on, bro. I ain't getting sent nothing, hey, man. Listen, I'm, man. I'm, big up bait, man. <laughs> Fucking shit. I ain't even bait. That's eight. <laughs> <laughs> that's that like fake bait. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, like, like, share, subscribe. Uh, TikTok, Patreon. Patreon's only two pound. There's no reason for you guys not to sign up. But yeah, oh, man. Geez. You can find all the links on our Instagram and our TikTok. So, 
Yeah, yeah thank you for rocking with us. Um, some, some real fashionistas. Mm. 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 Oh, I was going to say... Do you know what I, mean? I tweeted this like a year and a half ago. I said, at some point, I'm just going to be wearing my Brendan's brand. I bro, just... at some point, I made that kind of decision yeah. like a year and a half ago where I was yeah. like, bro, I'm on these pods here yeah, all the fucking time and I'm wearing fucking all these other brands. Yeah. It's like, nah, let me just wear the niggas I fuck with. No, I'm just going to wear their shit, bro. Literally, literally. Like, yeah. fucking... I was gonna say as well. I didn't know if I were to bring it up on the pod or not. Yeah. Have you fucking buck lead? Yeah, I fucked in Paris. <laughs> oh, okay, I was like, like yo. Paris. Have you spoken? I, I was like, yo. Where it is? I'll be so. Real. I remember when that drama happened at the time. Like, I was like, I don't. 